30 Brilliant Beauty Hacks Used by the Royals to Look Flawless When the whole world is watching you, having great skin is no longer a perk. It's a necessity. The glowing complexions of members of the royal family are not the result of coincidence or accident. They know that the appearance of their skin is a direct reflection of their overall wellness. And if you want to replicate the royal's flawless look and their skin's dazzling brightness, here are the lotions, potions, and rituals they use. Here are the 30 brilliant beauty hacks used by the royals to look flawless. Number 1. Face Exercises A particular kind of facial training is something that royals perform to strengthen the muscles just below the skin to produce fuller upper and lower cheeks. It consists of smiling for 15 repetitions in a row. In order to complete this trick, you'll need to pull your cheeks forward into a smiling position. Then release the tension in your facial muscles. The more effort you put in, the more defined your jawline will be. You may think it's silly, but it really does work. In fact, it's the reason why the cheekbones and jawlines of royals are so much more chiseled than those of other people. Number 2. 3-Step Eyeshadow the Princess of Wales actually did her own makeup for her wedding. Although she did get artistry help from Hannah Martin, a skilled beauty artist for Bobby Brown. The kit had three different hues of eyeshadow, ivory, rockstar, and slate. Ivory was to be applied all over the lid, while rockstar was to be applied on the lower lid. It's also said that she makes use of the long wear gel eyeliner in black ink by Bobbi Brown in order to get the ideal smoky eyed look. Number 3. Rosehip Oil Rosehip oil is extracted from the fruit of the rose shrub. It's packed with vitamins, which work wonders for the overall complexion. It's an excellent natural option for moisturizing. It can fight against symptoms of aging and pigmentation and it even moisturizes and restores damaged skin. All of these benefits make it a fantastic all-around moisturizing product. In fact, the Princess of Wales continues to use Trilogy's rosehip oil as an essential component of her daily beauty routine. The way it makes her skin feel is one of the things she appreciates most about it. Number 4. Covering the Roots of the Lashes with Mascara it's not like Princess Diana just applied some mascara and left the house. In fact, the late Princess Diana's cosmetic artist, Mary Greenwell, instructed her to ensure that she coated the roots of her lashes as well as the lashes themselves whenever she applied mascara on her own. What you want to do is start from the corner of your eye and slowly move across before brushing it through the remainder of the lash. Your eyelashes will seem to have more volume and fullness if you apply the mascara in this manner. Number 5. A Royal Can Do Makeup On The Go In our fast-paced world, who has the time to regularly apply makeup while standing in front of a mirror? Even Princess Eugenie, who's the niece of King Charles III and the granddaughter of Elizabeth II, is a busy person who has to get things done quickly and efficiently. She once told Harper's Bazaar that she applies her cosmetics while driving. I'm pretty excellent at doing it while I'm moving about too. I use Charlotte Tilbury and Bobbi Brown products, namely Bobbi Brown Bronzer and Charlotte Tilbury Mascara. They're absolute masterminds. Both of these items are available at any and all local Sephora locations. Number 6. Tea Tree Oil Tea Tree Oil is a kind of essential oil that has several functions, including those in the care of your hair, skin, and nails. Even though it's not the most glamorous of cosmetic products, the Duchess of Sussex, Meghan Markle, always has a bottle of it on hand since it's the royal family's little cure-all. Tea Tree Oil is an excellent antibacterial that can be used on wounds and scrapes. It may also help ease skin irritation and the itching and discomfort caused by mosquito bites. And it can even clear acne. Markle told Allure that she carried it with her all the time. 
Number 7. Lip Balm Hack Royals never undervalue the effect that a high-quality lip balm may have on their lips. Our lips are sensitive and need to be protected at all times. Regardless of whether you're braving the blazing heat of summer or the frigid air of winter, the Duchess of Sussex, Meghan Markle, has done extensive research and experimentation with a wide variety of lip balms. And she's concluded that the French Sugar Advanced Therapy Lip Treatment with SPF 15 is the superior product. That makes the lips buttery soft and easily kissable. Number 8. Making Eyes Pop with Highlighter Meghan Markle is no stranger to early mornings and late evenings, having previously had a role in the widely acclaimed television drama Suits. The Duchess of Sussex uses a highlighter similar to Yves Saint Laurent's Touche d'Eclat in the inner corner of her eyes whenever she has an important event to attend. This helps her seem fresh-faced and alert no matter what the occasion may be. Markle stated in an interview with Birchbox that this tactic is really handy when we're working at 3 a.m. There's nothing more effective than a nice highlighter to bring life and vibrancy to your eyes. Number 9. Sulfate-Free Shampoo When you combine regular shampoo with water and massage it into your scalp, the bubbly texture that results is due to the presence of a chemical called sulfate, which is found in ordinary shampoos. Sulfates are problematic because they have the potential to deplete your hair of natural chemicals, oils, and proteins that are essential to maintaining your hair's health, length, and thickness over time. Therefore, in order to maintain the moisture, shine, and overall health of her hair, the Princess of Wales uses the sulfate-free shampoo with botanical elements that's formulated by Richard Ward called Cleanse and Condition. Number 10. Eyelash Curlers The fact that Meghan Markle genuinely counts her Shu Umera eyelash curler as another technique to cheat sleep may come as a surprise to you, but it's the truth. She told Birchbox that after using the product, even if you don't have a stitch of makeup on, you instantly seem a little more alive. And the reason we know she's speaking the truth is that this demonstrates that the eyelash curlers are one of the most underappreciated tools for applying cosmetics. Despite the fact that they're widely available, it gives an appearance of longer and fuller eyelashes without having to use six layers of mascara. Number 11. Makeup Primer Applying a makeup primer after cleansing and toning helps the foundation. Tinted moisturizer or concealer that follows adhere better to the skin. The Laura Mercier Primer is a must-have cosmetic product for Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex. It's a lightweight, creamy gel that's perfect for setting makeup. In an interview with Beauty Banter, Markle shared the following information about her makeup routine. I use foundation unless I'm recording, so this is what I put on every day after moisturizer to give my complexion a dewy sheen. It's not flashy, but it does a good job of lighting. Number 12. Makeup Moderation Mary Greenwell, Princess Diana's makeup artist, showed the world that little is more when it comes to enhancing one's appearance. Greenwell divulged the technique that she used to get her signature look, and it turns out that the key is to exercise moderation. She said in an interview with Stylist in 2012 that you can blend large lips with a heavy eye. The secret is to apply a subtle blush. You just need to deal with two aspects instead of three. Number 13. Neutral Nails Ballet Slippers is a translucent pink shade that's been produced by Essie since the 1980s. The late Queen Elizabeth wore this shade personally, and in true royal fashion, each of the other royal ladies has followed suit by painting their nails a neutral color. According to her manicurist, Kate Middleton, the Princess of Wales, chose a blend of two neutral shades for her wedding manicure, Lac Ultra Shine in Rose Lounge Bourgeois and Essie's Allure. Both of these shades have been discontinued since the royal wedding. The combination of hues results in an eternal sheen on a translucent pink. Number 14. 
Eyeliner Hack Prior to meeting her makeup artist Mary during a 1991 Vogue photo shoot, the late Princess Diana often used blue pencils to draw on her eyeliner. Mary guided the princess in the direction of more muted eyeliners, such as beige and brown. According to Greenwell, the thing that I altered most about Princess Diana's look was really going away from the blue liner, which was quite old for her. This was the primary adjustment that Greenwell made to Princess Diana's appearance. You can see Diana before and after Greenwell pictures to see how much of a difference a single stroke of eyeliner can truly make. Number 15. Exfoliation Hack It's natural to be curious about the Duchess of Sussex's skincare routine, as her complexion always seems so radiant and healthy. Meghan Markle's disclosed to Allure that she incorporates Tatcha Rice Enzyme Powder into her daily beauty regimen. This powder provides gentle exfoliation since it just kind of foams on your face. The enzyme powder works as a gentle exfoliant that may be used every day to provide a smooth canvas that's ready for makeup application. Enzymes derived from rice and papaya are included inside the powder, and they work to emulsify, exfoliate, and delicately loosen grime. Number 16. Hair Length Hack the late Princess Diana initially had the poofy hairstyle popular in the 1980s for a considerable amount of time until she met the famous hairdresser Sam McKnight, who motivated her to make a significant change in her appearance. After deciding to have a pixie cut, Diana ended up being an even more iconic figure in the world of fashion than she already was. Number 17. Body Lotion what a decent body lotion can do for your skin is incredible. In fact, the glitter that the Duchess of Sussex exudes is because she uses Nivea Skin Firming Hydration Body Lotion, which can be purchased at any neighborhood pharmacy or drugstore. Megan confirmed to Beauty Banter that she always uses this product. I can say without a doubt that this is my go-to lotion, since not only is it very reasonably priced, but it also leaves my skin looking and feeling fantastic. If I could only track this down, I would immediately purchase a whole case of it. Number 18. Cleanser The key to clean, glowing skin is a regular skincare program or regimen. But what if you just can't seem to find the time or energy to go to the bathroom sink and wash your face? In that case, what are your options? Megan loves the Biore Daily Cleansing Cloths for all her cleansing needs. She told Beauty Banter that she feels they are excellent to have in the vehicle and your bedside when you have those awful lazy evenings where the prospect of really getting up to wash your face sounds intolerable. Number 19. Skin Hack to Glow Like a Diamond girls may be aware of how crucial it is to establish a balance between having an oily face and making a mess with powder on their face. According to Meghan Markle's interview with Allure, the Makeup Forever HD powder makes your complexion seem bright and fresh, but not greasy shiny. The HD powder is a loose finishing powder that offers unfiltered perfection for all skin tones. It's available in a variety of shades to get further blurring, just apply a tiny quantity to a fluffy brush, blot off any excess powder, and then apply the product after your regular makeup regimen. Number 20. Q-Tip Hack in Makeup Correction If you believe that the sole function of Q-Tips is to clean your ears, then you're in for a rude awakening. In fact, they may be of quite good assistance when it comes to the process of applying or correcting makeup. It's also possible to use a Q-tip to smooth down strong lines, as stated by Mary Greenwell, the cosmetic artist who worked with the late Princess Diana. According to her, I wanted to have Princess Diana with an eye that was extremely delicate, a very functional eye, but one that was never too much. After that, I went in around the eyes with Q-tips to smooth down the rough lines. Number 21. The Perfect Hair Flip Hack the Duchess of Sussex has perfected the simplest and most effective remedy for in-between blowouts that has never been seen. A hair flip, they say, is like nothing else. 
Markle has the perfect hair flip, as you would have noticed more often. According to her, when my hair's feeling a little weighted, Suzanne, my hair artist on set, has me bend forward and she sprays a little orb dry texturizing spray and then she has me flip back hard to give her hair a little bit more bounce. Number 22, Flawless Smoky Eye Look. Maybe most of you already admire Kate Middleton's flawless smoky eyed look. It's been said that the Princess of Wales uses the black ink version of Bobbi Brown's longwear gel eyeliner. It's essential for Middleton, who's often busy and doesn't always have time for a fast touch up. That this eyeliner from Bobbi Brown provides eye opening definition and generates exactly the appropriate amount of smudge and smolder without any extra eyeliner extended to the top of the eyelid. Furthermore, this gel-based product is waterproof for a period of 12 hours and is also resistant to perspiration and humidity. Number 23, Skin Glow Hack. The late Princess of Wales, Diana, was famous for her healthy, radiant complexion. Everyone desired to have such a glowing appearance. But the question is, how can we truly do that? You'll need a large brush for the bronzer or blush as recommended by Mary Greenwell, the cosmetic artist who worked on The Princess. Her recommendation is to begin by applying a highlighter to the apples of the cheeks, followed by a contour shade. The next step is to apply blush to the highlighted points of your cheekbones and bronzer throughout the perimeter of your face, between your ears and up to your hairline, and you'll have a glow like late Diana's. Number 24, Sleep Time Skin Hack. When you have a schedule as packed as Kate Middleton's, you'll want to maximize each and every second of the day, even the time you spend sleeping. It's well known that the Princess of Wales uses the Beauty Sleep Elixir in order to make her skin seem more radiant when she's getting her beauty rest. The Duchess of Sussex reportedly keeps a stockpile of it on her nightstand, and she may even be the one who first told Meghan Markle about the substance, according to credible insider sources. For really ageless skin, the serum contains 14 plant-based oils that inhibit the activity of the enzyme that's responsible for aging and prevents the breakdown of collagen and elastin. Number 25, Late Queen Elizabeth Skin Care. The late Queen Elizabeth, who lived to be almost 96 years old, maintained her impeccable style right up to the day she passed away and the credit for her flawless appearance was given to the skincare brand Elizabeth Arden, which had the license to produce cosmetics for Her Majesty. When your job description requires you to constantly shake hands with dignitaries throughout the day, having a multitasking cream that can lock in moisture to the face, encourage healing from the heels to the toes, and deliver deep conditioning to the palms is a beneficial advantage to have. Number 26. 16th Century Royal Skin Whitener During the Elizabethan era, people generally avoided using cosmetics since it was thought that they prevented the flow of positive energy. However, having pale skin was considered so desirable that people were willing to use materials like lead and arsenic to acquire the desired appearance. In an effort to preserve her reputation as the Virgin Queen, Queen Elizabeth I chose to apply cosmetics in a shade of white and light beige. Ceruse, which consisted of a combination of white, lead, and vinegar, was really the most popular beauty product during the time period. The term skin whitener was often used to refer to it through the 16th century. Number 27. Cut back on drinking for skin. Given her reputation for wearing natural makeup, it's easy to see why the late Princess Diana continues to be a source of inspiration for many different beauty trends to this day. As for the radiant finish that Diana achieved, the cosmetics artist Mary Greenwell, who began working with Princess Diana in 1991, had this to say about it. Diana did everything in moderation. She cut down on how much alcohol she drank so that her skin would look great. Number 28, Cleanser. If you want to have healthy skin, one of the most essential things you can do is make sure you wash your skin regularly. This may seem silly, but it truly is one of the most vital things you can do. During a recent conversation with Harper's Bazaar, 
Princess Eugenie said that Jo Malone's eucalyptus plants and mint cleanser is her absolute favorite product and that she uses it on a nightly basis as a skin cleanser before going to bed. Number 29. Balmoral Lipstick The late Queen Elizabeth II really liked lipstick since she had a custom hue made to go with her coronation garments in 1952. The delicate red-blue lipstick from Clarence was given the moniker the Balmoral Lipstick in honor of the royal family's Scottish estate, Balmoral. Until her death, the queen still applied her favorite lipstick every day. On many occasions, she'd been seen doing makeup when she was out in public. Number 30. Bun Compliments The sloppy bun at the nape of the neck is Meghan Markle, the Duchess of Sussex's go-to hairstyle. The hairstyle goes well with the headwear and doesn't steal any of the spotlight from the Duchess's ensemble. One of the most significant benefits of wearing hair in a bun is that it can be quickly and simply restyled into a wavy look in the evening. Unwinding it is all that's required of her in order to create waves that are elegant and smooth. Another benefit of wearing your hair up throughout the day, though, is that it's less likely to get damaged. There you have it, the top 30 brilliant beauty hacks used by the royals to look flawless. Thanks so much for watching! If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to get notifications on future content. See you in the next one!